Come on, Bert. I wrote it the way you wanted me to write it. With that fun, sand between the toes, relaxed feeling. You wrote it like you're still covering DC, Jeff. It's not like when you worked here before. You know, no one wants light and airy. Yep. <laughs> More sand between the toes. Got it. Jeff, thank God I found you. What's the matter? I'm freaking out a little. That's all definitely freaking out. Come on. We talked about this. You agreed you were not going to come to me like this anymore. But this is different. Oh, thank damn it. I, I know. You did your part, more than your part when we were kids, after Mom and Dad died. You were there for me. You are 20 years old. When I was 20, I was already in college, working two jobs, taking care of... I'll never be you again. It's just, I got my own problems these days. Why do I get you mixed up in this? I mean, contact with him. I think they're after you now. Make contact with who? Who's after you? You know what? Don't tell me. It, it's not that. I'm clean. No drugs. Then what is it? It's a TV show. I know how it sounds, but, but it's, it's not just a show. The show's called The Cult. Cult. I want to help. Please help me get away from this. Away from a TV show. <laughs> Nick, when I came back from DC, we said things between us were gonna be different. <laughs> you know, as crazy as it sounds, I was hoping to get some support from you for a change. Or at least a break from all the drama. Just let me explain. <laughs> you know, I've been through these these obsessions of yours too many times, Nate. Yeah. Not this time, Nate. This time you're on your own. You came. You didn't think I would? Well, you didn't have to. Look, I, I don't mean to keep involving you in this. I'm already involved. I work on the show. So where is it? Nate had it hidden. In a place he knew only I would find. It's identical. To the one Collins finds on the show. Do you know what's on that disc? The one on the show? When Colin puts it in her computer, it instantly uploads all her personal information. Uploads where? To whom? It lets Billy Graham's people totally hook into her life. So what happens next? Nobody knows. Stephen hasn't sent us those new pages yet. Just who in the hell is this Stephen Ray? He's like this total recluse. I've never even seen him. Yeah, well, he's the one I need to get to. He'll never get to Stephen. Watch me. Are you sure you want to? Look, it may be nothing, or it may have all the answers. It's the only connection I have with Nate. If I don't try and find him, no one will. Online. Yeah, well, whatever it's gonna do, let it. Why did you lie on your story? You must have had a reason. <sighs> I lied to protect my source. My real source. If I hadn't lied, those scumbag cops would have killed him for sure. I made a judgment call, and I would do it again. I never told anybody the truth before. Never even told Nate. But you told me. What do you people think, huh? That we wake up in the morning and say, today is a good day to kill someone. Where's the fun in that? Half the excitement is the planning, the buildup. That feeling you get in your stomach when you watch them leading the mundane existence with not a clue as to their fucking fate. I mean, they should thank me, right? I'm putting them out of their misery. Ending the hell that they call their lives. But no. No. They plead. And they scream. And they beg for mercy. At least, you don't do that. Because contrary to popular belief, the sobbing, pathetic, dribbling victim is no fun at all. <laughs> I had this one guy. He thought that he would try and become my dad. I fucking hated my dad. Started yelling at me. 
don't know. Maybe he thought I would crumble into a trembling mess. <laughs> Little did he know. But I made him pay. Yeah, I stabbed the shit out of him. So, I guess you must be wondering, huh? Why you? Why me? It's pretty simple, really. Very black and white. I like to hurt people. And you are people. Just another empty vessel walking around this godforsaken planet with his head full of grand ideas trying to make sense of something that cannot be made sense of. I and that I am, and you are that you are, and now 